Hi boys and girls, it's Mrs. Mitchell here. I'm going to read a story to you titled Hanukkah for all of our friends that celebrate Hanukkah. Written by Ronnie Schoeder, right? That's the writer, they write the words, it's also known as the author. Illustrated by Marilyn Hafner, an illustrator draws the pictures. Let's learn a little bit about Hanukkah. In darkest December, night steals in early and whisks away the light. But warm inside, Marna, Papa, and Grandma Rose light the sun. And here they are, they're lighting the, this is called a menorah. While Nora and Dan, Ruthie and Sam sing a song that is a prayer, Birthday, Mo points and drops his bottle. Hot! No, Hanukkah, Sam says. Say Hanukkah, Mo. Abada, Mo, Mo says. Abada, and drools on Sam's hand. Mo is a baby. Come on, Nora whispers to the others, and while the candles burn bright, five small children slip out of sight. Nora and Dan in the kitchen fry some batter. Flip flap here, flip flop there. Potato pancakes in the air. Lockies flying everywhere. That is a type of food that they like to eat during Hanukkah celebrations. Ruthie in the bedroom mixes some paint, a drop of blue, a drop of red, a drop of purple on Rabbit's head. While off in a corner, tucked away, Sam shapes a dreidel of clay. Top, Mo shouts, spinning round and round. Yes, dreidel, Sam says, for Hanukkah. Say Hanukkah, Mo. Anua, Mo, Mo says, Anua, and drools on Sam's foot. I think Mo's having a hard time saying Hanukkah. Then, one by one, their gifts in hand, the children gather around. You get a gift for each day during Hanukkah. Grandma carries her favorite dish, pot roast, warm and brown and rich. Papa brings his salad, cool and crisp, and Mama her applesauce. Delicious, Mo says. The lockies have landed. The lockies have landed, Sam shouts, holding out his plate. Mo grabs five, unable to wait. And as the Hanukkah candles lean head to head, so does the family. Ooh, ah, uh, um, yum, burp. They're all full from eating their delicious dinner. And there is the menorah burning bright. But wait, there's more. There's no escape. It's Grandma's famous lemon cake and cookies and candies and fruit and nuts. And now that's all. Enough's enough. Time for presents or what's a party for songs for dances and something more. Love, light, Hanukkah. Say Hanukkah, Mo, Sam says. Come on, Mo, say Hanukkah. Hanu, murgur, gurgles, nanu, Mo drools, Hanu, Mo giggles. Hanukkah, Mo shouts and hugs Sam. Hanukkah. And as the candles burn low and lose their light, Eight sleepy people say good night. The story of Hanukkah. For more than 2,000 years, the old and beautiful holiday of Hanukkah has been created by Jewish people for eight days each December. Hanukkah recalls a time long ago when the Jewish people, led by Judah Maccabee, fought a king named Anakus for the right to worship their god instead of the many gods of the Greek religion. When the Jews won the battle, they cleared away the statues of the Greek gods and rededicated their temple to one god. Then they celebrate it for eight days. According to legend, Judah Maccabee searched for some pure oil to light the temple menorah, but found only enough to last one day. But then a miracle occurred. The oil burned for eight whole days. That miracle of lasting light has come to symbolize the meaning of Hanukkah, a celebration of the freedom and determination of Jewish people to practice their religious beliefs freely. The end.
Happy Hanukkah.